going on folks dave and i are out it's getting to be about that time of year again start looking for some rattlesnakes it's uh what's today's date end of may something may uh 20, 20 uh 8th yep may 28th now we're out just scouting an area we've been to but haven't fully explored yet so we're gonna check it out see if we can find some snakes and uh getting pumped up for the snake season coming up here in a couple weekends yeah, it's good. Cold nights, warm days, uh, snakes should be out. First hint of sunlight on the rocks to start warming up. So, I suspect we'll definitely see some today because last night got down pretty cold. Um, so, we'll see. Again, this time of year, we're not allowed to uh, touch or harass them. We could just observe because they're not in season. So. But it's always fun to find them. Here, a little one, sounds like. Yep, yeah, small one. There's one right there. Sweet, first one of the day. Not half hour into it. So, so we're definitely in the right location. What color was that one? You get to see. Uh, it's black face. I just caught the tail of it. Here goes another one. Maybe it wasn't. Hear that one? Yeah, I can hear him down there. Maybe it was something else that moved. Huh, my first one today, that's a good sign. Yeah. He wasn't fully out yet. But it's, well, it, it's, it's still early. It's still early. He was still waiting for uh, things to warm up a little bit more. Remember, it's been cold all night, so they've been sitting all night in this, you know, in this low temperature. It takes a while for their bodies to heat up to the point where they start moving around. That's the whole purpose of basking in the sun. I thought I heard something. This ain't getting the sun. No. It will eventually. may not be historically like a den site but it really opened things up in here for that for basking rocks you know what i mean but a lot of these rocks are bleached enough that you know it's been open for a little it's while been open for a while probably who knows how long i mean but you can see this one tree here look at this thing mm -hmm. burned burn down brought it out coming across <coughs> walking this opening found a piece of rattlesnake spine so they're they're in the area. We found one so far. We're just hiking out along this ridge line right now, trying to find an opening with some rocks in it. <laughs> so we're kicking we're kicking off the rattlesnake season the right way by uh, going through the thickest laurel we can find. But that's how you find them. No, I don't think we'd have made it up through here. Fuck no, look at this, man. Where you at? I'm right behind you here. You just can't see me. It's so thick. What's up? No, I don't think so. I think there could be one in the future in those rocks up there, but not right now. That's 
All right, Dave, walking out this road here. Yep. Second snake of the day, first one we've actually seen, seen. Yeah. Nice yeah. little black face. Yeah. I don't think that might be a male. I, I don't know. I'd imagine it is. Young male? Yeah, I mean, there's, there's, uh, yeah, females will probably be at a den site or close to a den site right now, so probably be a male just wandering around. So somewhere close by there's going to be a den site. You just have to find it. He's looking at his tail. It doesn't really, I mean, a little bit, but it doesn't really neck down like, like females do. Alright. Just mind his own business out for a mid afternoon walk, huh? Oh, yeah. God dang, that thing's awesome, man, isn't it? Don't worry, buddy. We ain't touching that. You can see how unaggressive they are. Sensitive are they are to their habitat, the specific habitat. So, you know, you know, most states in the eastern United States, especially in the Northeast, uh, have, uh, you know, decimated the rattlesnake populations. Pennsylvania still has a great rattlesnake population, and it's a testament to the wildness and the uh, forested area of the state we still have, and how rugged it is, the inaccessibility of parts of the state to where the uh, rattlesnake populations couldn't get, get eradicated. You know, so if you have rattlesnakes in the area, that means that the uh, the ecosystem's in balance. It's cool, man. I love it. Look how friggin' nice that thing is. He's got some good color. Oh, well, he's, he's got a molt, it looks like. And I just want to go down and scoop him up. Take him home for a pet. Just wanna... Honestly, they are they're so docile you forget that they can yeah. they can kill you, you know. I mean people don't even understand how unaggressive they are. I mean look at this thing. This thing just is retreating, he's backing up. He don't even wanna he don't want anything to do with us. So people like killing uh, rattlesnakes indiscriminately just because you come across them or see them. You know, I, I could I could get in certain situations or in your yard or something, but to indiscriminately try to run over one or you're in the woods and would see one on a road like this and try to kill it, these things don't want anything to do with you. You know? Alright, well, let's leave this guy alone. We'll be on our way. And maybe we'll see if we can find any more today, what do you think? Yeah, let's, let's he come out of here, so let's cut down here. There might be some might be something we missed down over the hill here. Alright. Might be some more habitat or something like that. You know what, the whole day I didn't realize my shirt was inside out. <laughs> You know, I bet he's a little bit over 40 inches. We just found another one here. Coming down into this field, the spot's starting to heat up a little bit. Kind of hard to see with the lighting, but this one's uh, this one's quite a bit bigger than that last one. Oh yeah, I'd say that one. When he was spread out, he was probably uh, before you came down, he was spread out. He he was definitely probably at least 42 inches. So he'd be a legal snake. We rattles it, yep. I want to get her on the other side of him. See, people, people got look at this thing just in a defensive position, not an offensive position. Uh, he's probably got at least eight or nine buttons yeah. on him. 
Well, I heard you yell. I, I, I yelled like a little girl because I, I didn't expect him to be there, man. I was just walking through him. Poof, there he is. I mean, right direct to my path. Funny thing is, we I didn't walk up in here earlier. You know where these rocks are up here. Where did we come through at? We were through this. We come this. through right through here earlier. We checked all this. I, I never came up in here. Oh, okay. Well, this is where they're at. Nice. I mean, he would be illegal, but black face. Look at that. Oh. Yeah, that's your third one today, huh? Yeah. Second one, we've got to take some video like footage of. That yeah, first yeah, one, it got yeah. under a rock pretty quick. Nice. Nice. That's sweet. Yeah, he's getting puffed up there, man. But look how defensive. Not, not offensive. Defensive posture, you know. Unaggressive. I love it.